fashionistas and fashionistas out there. It's your plus size fashionista. Mm-hmm. Yep. And this is going to be me showing you guys my new little look that I'm wearing right now. So if you guys want to know everything I used and all of that, then you guys know what to do. Keep it locked, Tanisas. Mm-hmm. Yep. Okay, okay, I'm back on my fashions, divas and dolls. Like I said in the intro before, this is going to be me showing you guys my new unit that I just created. I'm going to tell you guys everything I use. I went to the local beauty supply store around the corner of my house. I'm telling you everything I use, the prices and all of that. I use a spandex dome cap and this was $1.99 because I didn't want to do a quick weave. I wanted to be able to take this on and off so it can, you know, whenever I want um, some short hair, I can just wear it, whatever. Um, I bought 27 piece hair and it's model model dream weaver and it's in the color one and it was ten dollars even and then i got a half a pack of velvet i'll try velvet remy and it's in the color one and this was um 12.99 i got some hair glue and that was a dollar and then i got this right here and it was and that hair before y'all forgot to mention this was six inches and this right here is eight inches and it is Eve and it was it's called Bang Fringe. 100 human hair and it is in a 613. So yeah, I know it looks a little bit tad different. Um I was trying to go for something like my black wig that I've been rocking that y'all been loving. I was trying to go in that same direction, except I didn't want to do like a straight, like straight angled bang i want to do something real like funky really choppy you know really funky because i really want to show you guys that i can do different styles those that do not know i am very versatile um if y'all don't know i change my hair up like i change clothes like i change shoes like it's not a game like i one minute you will see some short Rihanna hair, next minute you will see some long, curly Beyonce hair. Like, that's how I roll. Like, I love to switch it up. I love versatility. I love trying, experimenting with different colors, different textures, um, things of that nature. So, I am a little bit like, uh, you know, this is a little bit new for me because I have been short, but I haven't tried anything this you know choppy this kind of texture and i did like i show you it's a 613 so it may appear gray looking because that's what my mom said but i'm like no it's not great this is 613 platinum blonde 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 but i want to do something different again i like i said you guys i want to experiment i want to try different colors different textures different cuts you know just show that i'm versatile to you guys that i can just do more than one thing i'm not known as you know the girl that loves the big big hair even though i love big hair i'm not saying i'm stepping away from that but right now i want to do this because it is really hot in missouri it's been like 90s 80 something so i really don't want to wear big hair right now it's too humid I don't want to deal with taming it and all that stuff. And as well as I don't want stuff all on my neck. I just want to be free from that right now. I'm not saying I'm totally stepping away from it. I'm not saying that. I'm just saying for the current moment. It may be a week. It may be two weeks. I really cannot tell y'all the time I will be wearing my hair short. I'm just saying at the current moment right now. But again, it can change at any given moment. Because I love to switch it up. That's just me. But yeah, you guys, tell me how you like it. I did everything myself. It's tons of videos on how to do a 27-piece quick weave. I was looking at this one YouTuber video. Um, it was really helpful until she went to, you know, use longer pieces and she didn't show that. So then I went to another YouTuber and I'll have both their names in the fashion box below as well as the link so you guys can check those out if you are wanting to learn how to do a 27 piece. Um, I really wasn't comfortable filming that as of yet. Um, I will tell you guys, it's trial and error. Um, I just went with the flow of it. Um, yes, I did have to 
do like two different sessions, two takes of doing it. Because when I first did it, I was not liking it. I completely took everything off the cap and started from scratch. So yeah, I would suggest you guys, if you're doing a 27 piece, please take your time. Do not be distracted. Like, do it, you know... At night, we have some free time if you're a parent or something or, you know, if you're off from work or something on a weekend or something. Just make sure you have some time to focus because with that, you do have to take your time. It's not like a rush hairstyle or anything like that. You do have to take your time so it can be how you want it to be as well as the placement, as well as the style, how you want it to, to look. Again, that's why I said placement. Placement is key with 27 pieces because that will later determine how you're going to style it and how you're going to cut it and how, you know, it's going to look on your face. So I would recommend you to use a styrofoam head and to do it up until, you know, you get to like, if you're wanting longer pieces like I did and then you put it on your head and you position it and do how you want it to do so it can be accurately and it can fall how you want it to fall. Um, so I will say that, um, again, this was trial and error with me. This was not the exact style I wanted. I, at first I wanted, um, a Rihanna type style slash Aryan from Love and Hip Hop Atlanta, but then, you know, me getting scissor happy, so it ended up like this. But again, I'm not mad. Um, it's all a learning process. You know, I will be doing this again. Next time, I know, take my time. Don't be distracted, you know, yeah. But yeah, you guys, so far I am digging it. So yeah, you guys, let me know if you're liking it. Like I said, I want to do something different, but I'm still a little bit, iffy i'm on the fence of it but again i love trying new things so i'm gonna rock with it but y'all let me know in the comment section below how y'all liking it on me so far i have some of my honeys on instagram telling me they love the cut it's firming my face they love how my face look with it um lately i just been loving the short looks on me i don't know why but i just been loving the carefree easy breezy short looks so yeah enough of me rambling you guys heads off i want you to do one thing for me stay fly stay fashionable for less also tell a friend to tell a friend to subscribe to my channel until next time honey nistas you guys know what i want you to do take care bye honey nistas mm -hmm. yep